Good morning, friends. A simple message. A simple word of encouragement. Glory, thank you, Yeshua. Trust God when he's calling you to fast and pray, even when you don't know and understand why. Trust him in it. It's He's calling you to something deeper. He's inviting you to uh, some to to sit and dine at his table. It's kind of, it's like a paradox. You're fasting from the whatever pleasures or uh, what what have you from in, in this in this world. Whether they even be good or 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 clearly that what we should be abstaining from to begin with. But we fast from the things here, and we feast on the things of God. We feast on Him at His table. God is calling us to a greater level of consecration. He is inviting us to consecrate ourselves. A lifestyle of consecration, a lifestyle of fasting, a new kind of fast, a fasting not out of emptiness, but a fasting out of a longing for him, a longing for the bridegroom, a longing and a hunger for more, for the fullness of God. It's God saying this. It's glorious because we think, we think we fast and we pray so that we can know Him more fully. And that's true. But God is saying, yes, I want to know you even more fully. Give me more. Yes, pour out more so that you can be emptied and I can pour into you. God so desperately wants us He knows us through and through. And so our heart is that we should, and heart cry is that, oh God, we want to know you in the fullness. Of, and we realize that we cannot know you more deeply, more intimately. Unless we are in that place and go to that place of the deepest surrender, of consecration unto the Lord, where the Spirit of God searches us and knows us and sees any anything that is of any hindrance and, and removes it with the sharpest of operation of the Spirit and of the sword, the Word of God. The Lord is calling you to deeper waters. He's calling his bride to consecrate herself and to make herself ready. Glory, thank you, Lord, for revelation. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Trust in the Lord. Lean not unto your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge him. He's going to direct your path. Father, I thank you for my brothers and my sisters. Lord, I thank you that you are calling. Lord, and that my brothers and sisters, Lord, that they have ears to hear. Father, eyes to see in faith. A heart to perceive and respond in love faith and trust thank you lord may the bride make herself ready in yeshua's name amen